The horses trample upon the training pitch. Mastering their craft at this academy, a young jockey is passionate about the sport. One such jockey is 20-year-old female apprentice Chidza Rusike. She stands tall amid the stereotypes that have portrayed the sport as a male domain in Zimbabwe. I've been doing horse riding for two years and I do it because I love horses. Uh, we started like we were five girls, but I'm the only girl left. The others were scared, the others couldn't do it. Throughout my years, I've seen people come and go. I mean, they've tried, they've been as keen as beans, but just one day they can't do it, they can't handle it. But I hope that the apprentices appreciate what I'm teaching them and I hope they can get the determination to see it out. Chidza hopes to inspire other young women to excel in the sport. I would love to encourage the other girls to come here yeah, because it's a great opportunity. It's a great thing. Like you get to experience the other side and they shouldn't be scared or get intimidated by the boys because what the boys can do, us ladies, we can do it better with determination. I see myself riding in the Melbourne Cup, being the first black jockey to win it, the female one. <laughs> But Chidza and her colleagues have another challenge to deal with. Horse racing in Zimbabwe has not been spared from the economic challenges facing the nation. It's reported that since the year 2000, the breeders and horse owners have experienced significant financial challenges. Edmond Nyabola, CGTN.